standard 7th subject maths chapter 4 angles and pairs of angles practice set 18 today let's learn about opposite rays look at the figure given alongside name the rays in the figure alongside yes the name of the rays are ray ba and ray bc name the origin of the rays the origin of the rays is vertex b name the angle in figure 1 the name of the angle is angle abc or angle cba so here we have the solution ray ba and ray bc are the rays point b is the origin and angle abc or angle cba is the name of the angle in figure 1 let's have a look at one more figure figure 2 name the angle in figure 2 alongside so you can see a arrow mark which denotes the angle we can name the angle as again angle abc or angle cba name the rays whose origin is point b so we can say ray ba and ray bc are the two rays with the origin point b so here is a solution angle abc or angle cba is the name of the figure alongside that is the name of the angle in the figure and ray ba and ray bc are the two rays whose origin is point b two rays which have a common origin and form a straight line are said to be opposite rays so here you come to know what exactly are opposite rays two rays we have ray ba and ray bc and the common origin is b so two rays which have a common origin here it is point b and form a straight line okay are said to be opposite rays so keep in mind how to identify opposite rays now let's move on to practice set number 18 question 1 name the pairs of opposite rays in the figure alongside now you can clearly see that point p is the common point for ray pl and ray pm and they are lying in a straight line so we can say that ray pl and ray pm are opposite rays we have one more opposite pair of opposite rays that is ray pn and ray pt they are also having point p as the common origin and they are lying exactly opposite to each other in a straight line so we say that these two are the pairs of opposite rays okay let's go to question number 2 now are the ray pm and pt opposite rays look carefully ray pm and pt are they opposite rays give reasons for your answer so your solution is no ray pm and ray pt do not form a straight line and what's the reason yes that they do not form a straight line and hence are not opposite rays so this tells us that for two rays to be opposite they should have a common point and they should lie in a straight line so when they are not in a straight line you can give your solution as shown here no ray pm and ray pt are not in a straight line and hence are not opposite rays so this was a very small practice set for you 
practice it well stay safe keep learning thank you